In the United States, one in eight women will develop breast cancer, and it is by far the most common cancer in women around the world. However, only 65% of women over the age of 40 will get mammograms on a regular basis. Mammograms miss 15% of cases. Up to 40% of breast cancer cases are not found by mammogram, but rather by someone themselves. And over 12,000 women in the United States under the age of 40 are diagnosed with breast cancer each year, with 80% of more of that group finding the breast cancer themselves. Men also get breast cancer and they do not get routine mammograms. So all of this means that understanding the signs and symptoms of breast cancer and knowing what to look and feel for are critical in finding the breast cancer early before it spreads or progresses. My name is Kelly and I'm an oncology, lymphedema, and women's health physical therapist. And on this channel, I share videos on tips and tricks on how to manage your symptoms from cancer or lymphedema. So be sure to subscribe below for more videos. In this video, I'm gonna share and teach you the 12 signs and symptoms of breast cancer. Monitor for these 12 signs and symptoms on your self breast exams that you should be doing monthly. It's best to complete these exams laying down or standing in front of a mirror with your arms above your head. If you notice any of these signs or other changes not related to menstruation, pregnancy, hormones, or other medical reasons, be sure to reach out to your doctor. A thickened area of your breast. This density can be a normal sign of menstruation or breastfeeding, but if it worsens or doesn't go away, it can be a sign of breast cancer. A sunken or inverted nipple. For some, inverted nipples are a normal shape of the breast, but for those that it's new, the tumor can pull the nipple inward, flatten it, or cause it to sink in. A dimple. If there's a dimple or ridge in your skin that is not caused by a seam or tight clothing, it can be due to the tumor pulling the skin inward. This is best felt with your arms overhead. This will create a divot or a dimple-like shape, and if it doesn't go away or worsens, be sure to reach out to your doctor. A change in the breast shape or size. It's extremely common for women to have different size shape or breasts from the left compared to the right. And breastfeeding and menstruation can cause further fluctuations. But if your size or shape change does not connect to these issues, then you wanna follow up with your doctor. Nipple changes or scabs. If you see a scab-like area that is white or red over the nipple area that's not related to anything like breastfeeding, be sure to reach out to your doctor. A hard lump or bump. This is the most common sign of breast cancer. Lumps in the breast are very common and may be a sign of natural breast tissue. They may also be something like a cyst or a benign lump. But this is why it's important to do a monthly self breast exam because you will get to know your breasts and know what lumps are you and what lumps may be new or growing. If you have any hard lumps that are new, growing, or don't move very well, you wanna be sure to reach out to your doctor for further assessment of these lumps. Red or hot swollen breast. This is a common site of infection such as in mastitis from breastfeeding or from other skin changes such as eczema. However, breast cancer can stop the flow of lymphatic fluid, which may change the color of the breast. If you have any signs of infection or unknown reasons for this, be sure to talk to your doctor. A growing or enlarged vein on the breast. Veins can show up for circulatory issues, breastfeeding, or weight changes. However, if a vein becomes enlarged with other signs such as redness or swelling, it may be a sign of breast cancer. Sores on your skin. Breast cancer can cause tissue changes from the inside out and can cause sores or wounds on the breast. You may also feel a lump with the sore. If you have no known reason for a sore, this could be a sign of breast cancer. Also known as potorange, when the skin of your breast appears dimpled, similar to how a peel of an orange looks, this can be a sign of breast cancer. It's caused by swelling of the breast, which makes the hair follicles appear dimpled on the skin. Unexpected nipple discharge. Discharge is commonly related to developing breasts, infection, cysts, pregnancy, and breastfeeding. But if any of these common issues are not the cause, then it can be a sign of breast cancer. 
Itching of the breast. Itching can be a normal sign of skin changes, dryness, or even lotions or body washes that cause irritation. But if it doesn't go away with product changes or skincare, it may be a sign of breast cancer. So those are the 12 main signs and symptoms of breast cancer. Breast cancer can happen to both women and men at any age. So don't only wait for your mammogram. Be sure to get to know your breasts and your tissues so you can monitor for these signs and symptoms that we spoke about because catching the cancer early is extremely important. If you found this video helpful, please let me know by pressing the like button and I'll see you all next week for another video. Thanks everyone.